What is washi tape? Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is all about washi tape. What is washi tape? Well, let's find out. This is my first ever roll of washi tape and it's come straight from China. Washi tape apparently is Japanese. <laughs> so I couldn't find any direct sellers on Amazon France from Japan. So it's all come from China and I spent three euros and 12 cents that got me 12 rolls of washi tape. This is the first one that arrived and it's actually really small. It's the only one that's come in a box and the others at present at the time of doing this part of the video the rest haven't arrived. I ordered them around the 28th to 29th of November 2019. And the this one arrived, this very first one, arrived on the 2nd of January 2020. So it has taken a bit of a long time. Normally when I've ordered things from China, they have arrived within three weeks, which is really good. So this is the absolute longest I've ever waited for anything. So I thought we will have a look at this little box because I just can't believe how small it is for a start. <laughs> it's got, um, it's a cherry blossom design. Obviously all the writing is Chinese. I'm assuming it's Chinese. I don't know if it's Japanese. It should be technically. Um, it says it's made in China by a company who have designed it called Bentoto House. And in China or Japan, or both probably, it, washi tape is called masking tape. Now, masking tape to me is more like a painter's tape. It's, you know, yellowy, whitey, creamy, beigey. Um and you use it for masking off areas on a wall that you're going to paint. In fact, I have a roll here that I use. See, this is masking tape in the West. That's what we call masking tape. And that one's by Scotch. And it, as you can see, it is not decorated. It's just plain tape. So this came in the box, as you can see, and you see here, normally there's the paper you push out. Well, for me, I thought it was so pretty, I didn't want to bin them. And they look to me like little sombrero hats. So I thought I will use them in a sketchbook at some point. So we're going to open this cute little box. You can see here there's a gap. Now, I don't know whether you can use this as like a case like t unroll a little and thread it through and rip it off. I don't know if that's for purpose or whether you can just, you know, it's just a box and that's it. So let's have a look. Oh, it's very pretty. And quite thick, I think <clears throat> excuse me, that this is the thickest of the rolls that, that I ordered. Very, very cute. It feels very different. Oh, it feels like it's much, much thinner than um, what we call painter's tape or masking tape. It's much thinner to peel and hold. Delicate, I would say, is the word. And from what I have learned about it, which is limited, 
it seems to be it's paper that they print onto. So it's very fine and delicate. And then a very um, light adhesive is added. Um, the longer it, it sticks to paper or something, the tougher it is to remove it, apparently. So if you leave it stuck for, you know, maybe a week or so onto paper, it will eventually probably rip your paper. But a lot of artists on YouTube, I've noticed, are using this um, to mask off their tape, if that makes sense. Their, their paper, even not their tape. They're using the tape to mask off their paper when they're painting a picture. Doing two things at once is difficult. Trying to concentrate on what I'm saying and getting the tape back into the thing. Okay. So no, that's going to be too awkward, my thinking. So basically, because it's so tiny, I'll be putting it back in later. So yeah, I'm impressed. Apparently it's easy tear, we'll see. Uh-huh, looks like. Some artists use this in their sketchbook as a picture. Like they'll tear little bits and create hair for their hairstyle. I don't want to waste my washi tape. I think it's too pretty to, um, to waste if you see what I mean. So I want to try and make it last because I don't do journaling. Basically, you would use washi tape predominantly. It seems to be for scrapbooking, journaling, um, if you do, you know, your diaries and things. But artists, as I said, are using it. So I thought I wanted to introduce it on my channel. And I'm going to stop my video now, and I'm going to come back when the rest of my washi tape has arrived. This finally came. It's the roughly the 9th of January 2020, roughly three weeks after I've done my initial video of my washi tape introduction. The second roll I ordered in November 2019, well, the end of November, has arrived. And you can see its caps all around the edge. Plus, there are pink little cat paw prints all around the tape. I can't believe how small washi tape is. It's really tiny. Um, I suppose the uh, sellotape rolls in um, Europe is kind of, they're even bigger than this. But I thought the design is really, really nice. Some people think black caps are bad luck. <laughs> but for me, this is not, I'm not looking at it as black caps. It's more a silhouette artwork. Um, it's quite a thick roll. So now I'm just waiting for 10, the pack of 10 to turn up. It's the 30th of January 2020 and look what turned up yesterday on the 29th of January. Yes, finally the 10 rolls of washi tape have turned up. Slightly worried, I've been in decon with them because uh, they came from Wuhan 
China. And uh, I don't need to say more about that little, little concern. Okay. <laughs> I'll use that word. So I've soaked the package and all the washi tape in Surgical Spirit. <laughs> surgical Spirit is my friend. I do normally disinfect the post anyway, but um, I absolutely sat everything in the surgical and left it overnight. So there's probably no adhesive left on the tape. Let's go! Yay! Okay, so we've seen these two. Probably still a bit wet from all the surgical. But here are the ten rolls. Now, they are slightly different to what the image is on Amazon France. And I wasn't really sure what to expect for the price I paid, which I've got to go and research because I forgot, but um, it was really quite cheap uh, with free shipping. And so I couldn't resist it because I've never used washi tape. So, these are the colours. And we're going to probably have a look at the designs in the Arteza Street. Here we are. So I thought I'll try, uh, I think this one's still drying out <laughs> from the surgical. I'll try this one. Oh, it's still sticky. That's a bonus. And... Oh, yes, I could tear it. And we'll try purple. 